Now, Barbara was asked, what are the biggest mistakes women make with their money? Barbara replied saying, quote, they don't spend it. I am a believer in spending money as Ooh. fast as you can and believing that more money will come. So, wow. That's a money well, I mean, fast fast fast. Fast. Yeah. Barbara, who grew up poor, said her mother struggled to make ends meet. But she knew that everything would work out, and it always did. So, man, I... I, I like Barbara's statement up until the part when I'm taking words literally, but yeah. the part where she says, spend it as fast, fast as, as you, you can. can. Like, I don't, I, I do know people in my own family who hold on to that money and save it. And they don't, they, my mom still drives an old, old car. Um, I drove an old car until I didn't, you know, want to drive anymore. But um, I held on to everything just because I was afraid of losing money. Because I think it's just something yeah. that happens when you grow up with not much. Right. But then I realized, what you gonna do when you die? You gonna take that money with you? Exactly. That's a good point. You know what I mean? It's a great and so point. I think it's important now to spend enough to at least live your life fully. And I mean, like, if you need therapy, get the therapy to live fully. If you need a nice, you know, vacation. prized vacation or jacket or something that makes you feel like, I've never afforded something like this, treat yourself so you live fully. I think women make the mistake of not spending their money smartly. Yes. And a lot of women make the mistake of spending their money on a man. Ooh, yeah. they yes. do? Yeah. Or things yeah. that they think will get yeah. them oh, a get man. Oh, get them a man. Yes. I think that yeah. is... That's intentionality, yeah. too. Don't spend yeah. things to get a man. Spend things to get yourself. And I'm not saying... I have if, heard the, uh, so, go ahead. I'm not saying don't spend money on if you, you know, you have a boyfriend or husband yeah. or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saying just make sure that it's balanced. Yeah. And I think sometimes and it's wisely. we tend to... Exactly. Wisely and make sure that it's balanced. Have you guys heard the term... Um, scared money don't make no money or yeah, something like that. Yeah. And it's actually saying, like, if you're scared, like, sometimes investing in yourself, yep. starting a business, like, sometimes that might take a big, large sum of money, but it might lead you into something that could be so much greater. I even feel that way about tithing in church or doing something for a good oh. cause. Sometimes you can say to yourself, okay, this is the last $5 I got, and you may see somebody in need. I say give that last $5. I do believe God is going to give that back to you. I agree. I'm going to give 250 Huh? I'm gonna give 250. Yeah, I'm gonna give the whole, whole five, five. But, I'm, but I'm telling you, I'm giving I the 250. I'm no, giving the 250. No, I tie. No, I tie. I testimony tithe. of people who yeah. give, and they give without even thinking about it. They're like, I'm just gonna give this. I may not even have it, but yeah, I'm gonna give it, and God blesses them. Yes, tithe I is love 10%, your heart, though. Babe. Yeah, it is. Yes, I thought about that. Ten percent. Man, there are times when you think about that paycheck and you break down that 10 percent, and you're like. Man, can't this month just be an eight? <laughs> like, you just really, like, sometimes it's hard. I swear so it's, it always but works But I understand out. what you're saying. I, I get, get it, but... Have you ever been in need yes. and you've done something yes. really good for someone I'm a true else? I believer And the tithing. next day, I'll get a phone. Too. I'll literally, even do something for a family member or someone, they'll say, hey, I need to borrow this money, and you'll be like... Man, I don't really have it, but I'm gonna take this leap of faith and I'm gonna put that money uh, out there. I promise it to you, every time I've done it, gosh, I get the phone call the next day of a job opportunity, another door opening for me. So I agree that sometimes I, you can't be scared. You put that money forward, God will bless you. Smart money make money. Yes. Not not just giving it all. I'm yeah, sorry. I you give you half. I give you ten percent. That's God high. gives you wisdom too. Don't be dumb. <laughs> yes. It's the intention of also if you give money to friends or family. Consider it a gift. Think of it as a gift. Yes. When you start to lend friends or family money, right, and then you expect it to come back and things don't happen right and your spirit gets changed and yeah. all of a sudden you need to go to church for prayer. But if you tell me it's a loan... Oh, I'm just... I'm yeah, just and then they have a new Louis alone. bag, but they didn't pay you the money back. Tam, True. how do you feel? Oh, about... Well, when I think about spending your money wisely, honestly... Okay, I'm going to be real. You see a lot of child actors mm -hmm. out there who start art... Who's, you see a lot of child actors out there who start out well. Yes. Right. And after a while, they just spend their money on, you know, ridiculous Drugs. things. Yes. Um, <laughs> my mom taught Tia and I the, import, the importance of investing. Yes. Investing your money. Yes. Make money off your money. Yes. And I think the... No, yes, 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 it's that's true. great. And I think we don't hear about that a lot. I think when people hear about investment, they think that you have to invest, like, a lot of money yeah, to right. get a lot back. No, you guys, just start small. Start with $5, yes. and yep. you'll see. It'll grow to 10 Then that 10 will grow to 20 That's why Sister Sister is still doing okay. Yeah. 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 Still doing okay, because I invested. Yeah.